the only two who can overtake Melton. The first one is the former world champion, Michael Gaffney, a world champion cowboy on a world champion bowl. The two-time defending champion, Little Yellow Jacket. What can you say about this bowl that hasn't already been said? A filthy average of 93 points unwritten in 10 outs this year. Can Michael Gaffney do it? Oh, he's got a seat. To the right, he's into got his seat. hand. It's an off night for Little Yellow Jacket. And it's a huge it. night for Michael Gaffney. Gaffney. Oh, man, That's Michael it. Gaffney has done it. Gaffney three times has had that ball. He had him last week in Colorado Springs and bucked him off. He's never ridden that ball. Nobody has ridden this ball this season. Nine times, make it ten times out of 71 outs. And Gaffney is going to the record books. I want to point out one thing. I don't know what the score is going to be, but on a bad day for you little Yellow Jacket, you're still going to be 94, 95 points on a bad day. And that wasn't a bad, that wasn't that bad a day, really. Look at this bull buck. I mean, suck back underneath himself. Coming around the right, hopping, skipping. He's a little flatter right there, but then he's going to catch a gear. But so does Gaffney. Gaffney grinding the gears and the pedals to the metal at the same time. They're in sync. Finishes it off. Spurring for crying out loud. He's spurring little yellow jacket at the end of that ride. Just remember, this bull has been out 70 times, only ridden nine times previously. Average of 93. Hands down the best bull the PBR has seen in years. People don't want to get on him. Michael Gaffney not only wanted to, but stuck it on him. And we're just now hearing the score. Are you ready, folks? Sit down. 96 oh, points my. for Michael Gaffney, the high marked ride of the year, <laughs> one of the high marked rides in the history of the PBR. I got a three wow. bull total, 267 and a half. He is the leader. What a performance for a great guy. One man left. Corey Navarre needs 93 and a half on Ace of Hearts to beat him. Gets forward. It's to the left away from his hand. It would have to be spectacular, and it isn't. And Michael Gaffney conquers Little Yellow Jacket, the best bull in the world, to win his first title of the year. Hands down, the best bull rider this weekend. He rides three of them. Tough break for Corey Navarre. Wanted it so bad, but he still had a good performance this weekend. But all the credit, all the goods, and all the cash going to go to this guy. And it had been a struggle at times, even though he's ridden a high percentage of bulls this year, Michael Gaffney. Only four paydays all year long had made a sum total of $6,500 in the first 19 events of this year. But that has all changed now as Michael Gaffney at age 34 finds the fountain of youth in Idaho and sticks it on the best bull in the business. Our Super 8 ride of the night, take a guess. The G-Man, Michael Gaffney. It's your Super 8 ride of the year. Just sticking it on Yellow Jacket. Oh, you gotta be overjoyed for this guy. Man, I mean, he had his jaw set. He had his hammer cocked. His powder was dry. He was ready for the rematch against the greatest bull, maybe in the history of the sport of bull riding. Nobody had stuck it on him this year. And Michael Gaffney gets her done. I'm telling you what. It's a great way to win one. The greatest ride of the year, one of the nicest guys in the business on the toughest bull we've ever seen, and Michael Gaffney standing by with Leah. Just echo the words, I guess it was my night, but really, Michael, former world champion, so many great accomplishments in your life. This has to stop right up there. Oh, this is this is definitely the top relief. I mean, it's been, I mean, since I won the world championship in 97, this is this is a cherry on top. It's been a long time in, in coming, and. Uh, I don't know, it feels so good to finally win one after so long. I was beginning to doubt over and over again about uh, showing up to these things, so it feels good. Win one, you did, and on top of that, little yellow jacket. But now talk about the ride, because the, after the first jump, it almost seemed like you notched it up in terms of confidence. Did I see that, or was that really happening? Well, I talked to some of the guys before, and I talked to McBride, and I talked to Pee Wee and Ross, and... You know, it's just here lately, you know, he, as he kicks out of there and wads up, he's pulling everybody down and getting their feet. It's like he did with, to me last weekend in Colorado Springs. So I said, you know what, I'm going to go back to my old steer riding days and just stick my chest out and, and just do what we all try to do, and that's just try your guts out. And, uh, you know, it worked out it worked out great. He just he stepped out and he went into my hand, which I had a, I talked to Chad in Nevada. And I said, I bet he goes left. And sure enough, uh, luckily for me, he went into my hand tonight. And then once he gets into the spin, we talk about that too, that uh, 
he's just solid. If you can just get past that, those first couple of jumps, he's pretty good to ride. This, this here is what it's all about, like being a little kid again and telling a great story. Congratulations. Two wonderful champions tonight. Right, well thanks. done. Back to you guys. Leah, thank you, and congratulations to Michael. And he's been struggling for so long, he just went back to the basics. You know, that's what it's all about. You learn to ride bulls by just, just bearing down, lifting and gripping. A lot of guys ride the front end, use a lot more balance, but that's what he did. He stuck his chest out and got it done. Stuck to him like he had fly paper on his Wranglers. Congratulations, Michael Gaffney, your winner. Corey Melton came close, finished second. Justin McBride going to make up some ground on Adriano Marias. Justin finishes third. We round out the top with Coleman Bell, Brendan Clark, the Aussie, Mike Lee, and Tony Mendez. So that's going to wrap it up from here. Congratulations again to our champion, Michael Gaffney, who conquers the greatest in the world, Little Yellow Jacket, for 96 points for Justin McKee, Tuff Hedeman, Leah Garcia, and our entire crew here in Idaho. I'm Brett Haber saying so long.